Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for joining me today. Um, today I'm going to be, um, while well, I'm experimenting with uh, dot art or mandalas with dots. Um, and the reason I'm doing this is because um, it's, it's more like an art therapy when I'm down or I've got my down days or I don't know what to paint. Well, I've got an artist block, so I thought why not go into dot art because it is very, very therapeutic and actually it, it may seem very simple because this is my very first time doing this. It, it does look very easy to do, but you need a lot of patience and patience is something that doesn't come very easily to me. So um, this was quite challenging and actually very, very helpful because lately I have been uh, you know just down with you know issues and things that are going on and I just thought why not put my mind to something that is going to help me out do something that is going to be creative so I decided to do dot art um, so if you can see in the background I've got uh, a few that I've experimented on and these are pebbles that I picked up from my recent trip to the beach here in London and um, so on the top left hand corner you can see I've painted an eye and really you can paint anything on anything so I figured and of course that's you know that's quite um, art is open to anything and so what I'm doing now on a pebble is I've got a background that I did of a heart shape but of course you can see I didn't really follow the guidelines because that's just who I am and I guess all artists you know do you do draw guidelines for just so you don't go out of your um, the object that you're drawing uh, but I'm not really using it as you can see so um, these um, little tools that I got for um, the dot art I got them from eBay and I'll put the link in my uh, description box for anyone who wants to use um, these uh, tools and they're actually nail art tools and they're not very expensive to use and they come with different tips so for the different sizes of your uh, dots and they are very very handy and very easy to use but this art is not easy trust me and I also experimented on one of my acrylic pores that I've done. You can also see on the background, it's not the full image there, but I, you know, uh, did a background and then I didn't like the pore, so I covered some of it with uh, black spray paint and then I added my mandala dots around it. And it really is very effect effective, uh, I must say. So um, let me know what you think and if you've tried this kind of artwork, uh, dot art um, is very very therapeutic, very helpful and I must say it has helped me a lot. You know that is what art therapy is, it's just go in with whatever you want to do and make it work and get creative and get out of that low zone that you're feeling. I hope you all are having a lovely day wherever you are. Thank you so much for the new subscribers. Thank you so much for all the love on my channel. And if you'd like to see anything else, anything different, if you have any advice, comments, tips, and please don't judge me. This was my first time doing um, dot art and it is a little messy, but it's effective. So please try it. Let me know how it goes. Um, until my next video guys, stay blessed as always, I'll see you soon, bye.